Okay, video number three. I'll start with the grill. We put the grill on also about a year and a half to two years ago, and then I built this. It's a starboard container that the uh, propane tank is in, and then there's a tabletop to work on when you're grilling. And then we have uh, the cockpit floor. This is where the engine is accessed. So you asked about the engine. This is a 40 horsepower Yanmar. I'm gonna lift this up for you. 40 horse Yanmar diesel 3JH3E that is coupled to a Sonic Select. Actually, a British company makes it. A Sonic Select Outdrive that you can't really see. There's a coupling down there. Sorry about the video angle. And uh, yeah, the the Sonic Select Outdrive leg can tilt up. So when you're sailing, you actually don't have a prop in the water. Um, being a 40 horse, we can motor it at as high as seven and a half knots at full RPMs, but usually our cruising speed at, at you know about 2,500 RPMs is about six, six and a half knots. That is the diesel tank that I'm looking at right now, 50 gallons of diesel. Uh, there's a fuel water separator there, a fuel filter over there, and uh, yeah, the serpentine belt. Actually, the alternator failed about three, four months ago. There's a new alternator, and a new starter motor and a new starter relay that I installed. And then the other cockpit access. So these floors literally just lift up and you can completely remove those panels. Let me give you some perspective. This is from outside the cockpit looking down. That's the floor of the cockpit and the helm station over there. Seating all around. And then when I lift up this floor, those two access ports give you access to the select out drive or Sonic Select out drive. And then we have life jackets that are actually stored, well, they're stored from that opening locker right there, but you can see them where they fall down there. Um, and exhaust is over there. Some plumbing, little carpet drains. This is the, this hatch right here opens up and gives you access where we stuff all the, the daily used life jackets. We have other long-term life jackets stored down below in case we have extra guests on board too. That pump right there is the hydraulic pump that pumps up the outdrive. And that lever right there is what releases the outdrive to allow it to be pumped up. 